of Detroit. Just play a little bit lower. That makes sense? You do that, man, you can be a damn good player in this league, all right? I get the comfortable position, now I get back to my roots. I get back to the roots. <laughs> i tell you what, I'm, I'm trying to stay away. <laughs> you tube! Like, comment, subscribe for more thought-provoking content like this. Click the bell icon button. Now, I don't want to say this emphatically, and I don't want to be like a person who loses credibility off saying this, but I think that Tariq Woolen and the Detroit Lions are, is inevitable. I think that Tariq Woolen, the cornerback out of UTSA, um... This guy is, he's everything the Detroit Lions would get. He's everything they like, uh, the, same, the size, the speed. He's really raw. The RAS score, the uh, relative athletic score is going to be off the charts. Um, yeah, as you've seen in that clip, that clip is from Inside the Den. I encourage everybody to go watch it. It's their Senior Bowl episode. It just premiered, um, if you're watching this stream, it premiered on February 28th. And for me, you know, just seeing them interact with these players, I like that. I love that a lot, seeing how coaches coach, the different styles with Deuce Staley, as well as, you know, Campbell and and the, the secondary coach. I love I loved it all. You know, it was, it was great. It was a great shot. It was it was nice. And we got to see uh, Ben Johnson as well. We got to see his coaching style, how he is. And I think he's the perfect uh, quarterback or offensive coordinator for Jared Goff because he can he can criticize and he can do things and he can get things off in a very positive way and he can make you better. You know, he, he has a very strong working relationship with players. You can really see it. It comes off the screen as genuine understanding. Um, but it's that remains to be seen. But Tariq Woolen and Detroit Lions, man, he is just everything they want. I'm just looking at him. He just, he's everything they want. And I think that. It's going to be hard to draft a corner at 34. It's going to be even harder at probably 66 or 97. But I think Tariq Woolen, his cover skills, athleticism, big playability, the fact that he's raw, converted receiver to corner. I think it's close. I really do. With the right coach. Again, with the Aubrey Pleasants of the world, with the Aaron Glenns of the world, this guy can be very good. He already said it in the clip, as you saw, that this guy's going to be a good player because he plays high. And that's his only drawback, you know, a very raw and press coverage. But you know what? If he's not pressed on a receiver, I actually seen film on him. If he's not pressed on a receiver, it's bad news. So I... I'm really thinking Tariq Woolen goes to Detroit Lions. Um, right now, he's rated as the sixth best corner. And obviously, with the combine, everything being accelerated a little bit, he's going to be looked at primarily as maybe, um, primarily as maybe a day two guy, second or third round, depending on what you want to do. I, I haven't seen, I've even heard first round. He's a strong, aggressive tackler, good anticipation, catches the ball. With the right coaching, he can be a Brandon Browner, a Richard Sherman with the right coaching. As y'all know, I'm high on Tariq Woolen. Now, I only say that because seeing uh, Aaron Glenn with him, giving him advice and connecting with these players, seeing them connect with certain players just made me, oh my God, just made me like fawn over, okay, I know who they like. You know, and, and definitely a RAS score and the intangible is something they're going to like. But they're going to like, you know, they're going to definitely like a Tariq Woolen to go along with the Warrior, you know, Jacobs. They're going to definitely like Tariq Woolen. So be on the lookout for that. I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to sink my teeth in it, but it's something I'm interested in. A 4 3 40, a cornerback that's 6 3. Come on now. <laughs> Worst case scenario, he'll safety. Worst case scenario, 
So, like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you think about Tariq Woolen. Love y'all. Oh, yeah. And um, check out the Inside the Den. Uh, there's a lot of great content in there. I should have reacted to it. But it's a lot of great content in there. I hope y'all like it. God bless.